run the football, control the line of scrimmage, and keep the ball moving forward. A little tunnel screen to Tyrone Tracy. He shakes and takes his way for a first down. Jet sweep to Charlie Jones. He turns the corner. Charlie Jones down the sideline, stays in bounds, and is finally brought down by Michael Dowell. He'll give it to Goodson, and he will steamroll his way into the end zone for an opening drive Iowa touchdown. They made that look awfully easy. The offensive line, look at the left side, all those reach blocks. Great job by Ernst of getting up into that linebacker. You can put your abacus away now. Third down and six, Lombardi. Shirts off, a sack. The rush coming from the backside. He's still able to launch one down the sideline and throws an interception to Jack Kerner. Third down and seven here. Petrus finds a crosser. That's an easy pick up to Nico Regani for a first down and more. He's all the way down inside the 40-yard line. Becomes number two. He's changing their responsibilities. Petrus, pressure coming off the edge, flips it to Kelly Martin. He's got a first down in the red zone. And he's inside the 15-yard line before he's bumped out. Jump ball in the end zone, and it is hauled in by Brandon Smith for the Iowa touchdown. What a great adjustment by Smith. You see the leap right there. The catch and then kind of turning that body to make sure that ball doesn't pop out from hitting the ground. I still think Laporte is a great option for this offense. One deep safety. Petrus with a tip ball at the line. And Michigan State is able to force a three and out. Incredible, incredible experience to witness this in Iowa. Nice Barringer. Sends it to Charlie Jones. Makes the first man miss. That's to the sideline. Jones. Weaves his way to midfield, and he's in plus territory before he's finally brought down. Right where they go. Off the middle into the end zone, Tyler Goodson for the touchdown. Completions and struggling Michigan State offense isn't doing it right now. Looks one in the flat, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Barrington Wade. And he bulldozes his way down close to the red zone. A disastrous start for Michigan State. Second pick thrown by Rocky Lombardi. The long field out in front of Rocky Lombardi now, starting at the eight yard line. And throwing from the end zone. Here's the first shot downfield, man to man coverage. And that's what they've been looking for. Jalen Naylor gets it all the way down inside the 40-yard line of Iowa. With Lockett, Rocky Lombardi, that lack of comfort shows up when that ball looks like that going to the receivers. Erringer with a line drive. Jones has been a weapon, changing field position so far for Iowa. And he has a head of steam here. Inside the 10-yard line of the pylon and in for the touchdown. What a first half return-wise for Charlie Jones. That's his third big return, and this one finds the end zone and six more for the Hawkeyes. But the punt from the own end zone, the line drive punt, and now freeze it. Listen, this is why line drive punts don't work well. One, two, three, four, five, six guys on Michigan State are 45 yards from Jones. That line drive punt, he makes one guy miss. Look, no one is even remotely close to where he is. He gets 40 yards in the return without ever getting touched because that punt was such a line drive. Look at one guy misses. And look at all the space he has. Everyone's left. Back where that punt was kicked. Terrible lane distribution. Celebration on the Hawkeye sideline. Sack. Pulls one into coverage, and it's another intercept. 
interception. Riley Moss. It was thrown right to him. And it is a pick. Six. Moss up there. He's going to be playing this squat cover two corner technique. Now again, nothing's open. Rocky Lombardi moves. Now freeze it. Look at Rocky Lombardi. Go run to the sideline. You're in a two-minute drill. Moss is hanging out right there. Just go run. Run to the sideline. Get some yardage. But you decide to throw that football, and it equals an interception. Moss is just hanging out there in his zone. There's no reason to throw that ball. That sometimes is what it looks like quarterback decision making. Make the right play because it's the only play. Sean McVay used to say that to us all the time. Right now, the only thing you could do is run the football. He's off balance, forcing that throw downfield, and that's an easy interception for this Hawkeye defense. Spent zero time with the trainers these last few drives. Pocket collapses, and he goes down again. Zach Van Valkenburg all over the quarterback once again. You're going to get quarters down at the field. I think you just take your shot downfield for a jump ball. He almost threw another interception. Matt Hankins jumped in front of Ricky White and almost had a pick. No huddle offense in game to get him a great feel for it. Petrus brought down. That time the pass rush got there. Michael Fletcher was the number one defensive end recruit in the state of Michigan. He plays in this second half of over 30 or 40 yards to get back into this game. Yeah. And rush, and throwing it to nowhere is Lombardi. Are they going to say that's a loose ball? He threw it forward. Davion Nixon takes it into the end zone. Want to trigger and get themselves an interception. So that was something I learned during my time in the NFL with Gary Kuga. Lombardi well protected here, and here's a bomb down the sideline on third and long. Drops it into Jalen Naylor. How about that from Rocky Lombardi? Third down and goal. It's a handoff to the tight end. Hunt. He tries to turn the corner and does. Touchdown, Michigan State. by Hunt. Watch him come on this jet sweep handoff. And the defense for Iowa's there. Golston's there. Stiff arm and then go find the pylon. Great effort by Hunt. Everywhere in this Iowa football team today. Right off the go. Tyler Goodson breaking tackles. He's inside the 30. Still on his feet inside the 20. All the way down inside the five yard line before Kalen Gervin saves a touchdown and brings down Tyler Goodson. 71 yards. Following that fullback, this is what Iowa does offensively. And this one to Sargent. And he's in for the touchdown. So just like that, after Michigan State gets on the board, Iowa answers right back. And they are a point after away from a 35-point lead once again. Motion, and then watch Potterbaum. That left side of that offensive line work together. A great job by the fullback and then Sargent. Finding that little crease for that touchdown. Pioli, couple championship games. Eric Mangini as a coach. It's a nice move by Tyrone Tracy. So the Hawkeyes scoring their first offensive touchdown in the second half. In their last six Big Ten games, they had another. As Makai Sargent sneaks it inside the pylon. And Iowa pads their lead as they continue to blow out Michigan State. The edge. Watch Alaric Jackson gain the edge, then turn back. Brandon Smith get in the blocks. Goodson doesn't even have anyone to really block as Sargent finds the front pylon. You are about working hard, playing the right way, passion, execution. They're going to be watching this tape with a keen eye. Long throw by Lombardi, a sliding catch made by Ricky White. Speaking of which, that was a statement today by Iowa that they may have gotten off to a mistake-filled 0-2 start, but they are not to be taken lightly as they beat Michigan State the week after the Spartans beat Michigan 49-7. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe 
to ESPN+.